friends. I've been having to rethink some of my mining and crafting here on YouTube, and it's time to talk to you all about it. This video is going to have some open conversation about money, so just a heads up there. When I started this channel two years ago, I was struggling to function at all after contracting the plague on top of my pre-existing issues and had been stuck in bed for months. I was going stir-crazy because I couldn't do anything other than lay there and watch shows. So when I started being able to sit up and play video games and make Minecraft videos from my bed, it gave me somewhere to channel my need to do things. And it has served that purpose well over the last two years and given me so much more value than just that. In that time, I've also gone through a lot of personal growth and recovery from a not great past. And along with that, I've started figuring out who I want to be and what I want to do with myself. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the physical ability to back it up but I'm at the point where I think I'm ready to start working towards that future self. Maybe a little more slowly than other people might, but still, I want to work on it. And for me, that means continuing my higher education. Since I live in the US, that's not an easy feat for anyone, but for me specifically, I can't work three jobs to pay my way through like I used to. I've been lucky enough to be accepted into a master's degree program for health psychology, and I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to fund it because I refuse to go into debt. And I won't lie, as I've been doing the Minecraft YouTubing, I started hoping that maybe this could be a source of income for me. I already put a lot of time and energy into doing work that I don't feel right charging others for, so I don't. And with what I want to do with my life, that kind of work is only going to take up more and more of my time and energy. But I still have bills to pay, and sometime in the last couple of years, I began to hope that this channel might actually help me with that, especially as it's a job that I can do on my own terms. But I'm two years in, and not even close to just being monetized, and I simply can't afford to keep putting in the amount of work on this channel that I have been for the last two years without it giving me at least some reasonable financial support, because this next part of my life is going to cost me a lot in both money and energy. I'm still trying to figure out what I can do to pay for the degree, in addition to actually working on it, not to mention constantly working on scholarship applications already. Unfortunately, that's going to soon come at the cost of regular updates on this channel for the time being. I'm not going away entirely, but you'll see me a lot less. Sometime in the next couple of months, probably around the end of the year, I'll start posting as I can fit Minecraft into my schedule, rather than the nice weekly updates that I've been able to maintain for the last two years. I'm still undecided on what I'll do with streaming. Maybe I'll find that it's an easier way to share my gaming with you all, or maybe I'll stop doing it altogether. We'll see where that goes. I don't know if I'll actually be able to do these things. I'm already drowning over here, barely treading water while working a big old grand total of four hours a week. I'm terrified that pushing myself like this will just send my health hurtling downwards even faster that no matter how I try to pace myself in balancing all these different pieces of the puzzle, that it just won't be enough. That my body will forever stand in the way of my dreams and goals. My brain, or maybe just the fear of what others might think, tells me that I should probably focus on just working more so I can afford to go to the doctor. I feel guilty about trying to get an education while my physical conditions put extra strain on my partner and their income. I'm flip-flopping back and forth between denial of the fact that I probably don't have the physical ability to function enough to get an education and breaking down and sobbing from the sheer exhaustion of trying to have at least a little bit of a life. And yet, I have to try this. I have to try for the little girl who watched friends talk about saving for college knowing she'd never be allowed to go. I have to try for the little girl who tried to keep herself from dreaming of being called doctor. I have to try for the girl who never stopped teaching herself no matter how hard. And I have to try for me now, because even though my body does everything in its power to prevent me from being who I want to be, 
I can't bear to let that part of myself slip away yet. I don't know yet how I'm actually going to make it work, but I'm pushing forward into the blind uncertainty step by step until I either fall or make it to the end. I want to especially thank my Patreon supporters who have given me a little bit of financial support here because it gives me hope and confidence that you think I'm worth supporting as I go about working on this channel. But it's still not much and I'm going to put that report on the screen for you all to see. This is every penny I've made from this channel in the last two years. I've been saving it to invest back into the channel and will keep holding on to it to hopefully someday use for soundproofing. I definitely feel a little weird continuing Patreon at all if I'm barely putting anything out there, but I'm going to leave that in the hands of my supporters. If you want to withdraw that support, I fully understand and in fact highly encourage you to do so. If you want to stay, that's amazing and more than I deserve. I thank you. I won't lie and say this doesn't hurt to have to do. Minecraft and this channel have become such unexpectedly special and important parts of my life, and even more so, you, my audience, are so special to me. I've had a few good cries while facing this decision, and I just couldn't give up on the channel entirely. If I were wiser, I might say I'm on an indefinite hiatus but I've always been one to bite off more than I can chew and do it anyways. I don't really know what things will look like going forward. I hope to be able to finish my old Minecraft series somewhere in the early new year, and I don't plan on posting fewer videos for most of the remainder of 2024, but it's all very up in the air for me right now. However things shake out, I hope that you will be here waiting for me still because as long as you are, I want to keep coming back as much as I'm able. Thank you all so much for being here. I love you all so much and I hope we can continue making Minecraft memories together. This isn't the end. It isn't goodbye. Just see you around. <laughs>